Hello all and welcome to Duplicate Success International Monday Night Webinar. Today is Monday, March 6th. My name is Randy Krebs, Executive Goal Director from Salt Lake City, Utah. I have the distinct honor of introducing the host of tonight's webinar. He is a very well-respected business leader and mentor in this industry. You'll definitely want to have your pen and paper out, sitting up and paying attention as as you learn how this industry expert continues to build his business successfully. He has achieved the rank of Emerald Director within our company. He is the co-founder of Duplicate Success International. He is an amazing leader, mentor, and most importantly, I'm very proud to call him my son. Jared, are you on the line? I am, Dad. Thank you so much for the great introduction. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. Awesome. Well, welcome everybody to tonight's webinar. I'm really excited because we have some great content for you. We have some very special guests and I hope you're ready to take notes. I hope you're ready to learn because you're going to hear from an executive gold director who is on fire and two of her key team members uh, that were at this big event in Las Vegas by GoPro, the most successful women in network marketing. And before we get into the training tonight, I just want to remind you of our team DMO. If you do these three things, you will be successful. Number one, use the products every day, AM and PM. Number two, do your 222 for the day. That's get two new presentation videos out, two follow ups with prospects that are on the fence, two calls to existing clients or team members. That is what, that's the engine of your business right there, your 222. And then also 15 minutes of personal development material daily. That's books, audios, and or webinars. And those three things, if you do those things every single day, you're going to be successful. You can't help but make money and help people when you do these three things every day. So that's our DMO. Just like any business has their daily method of operation, a Subway restaurant would have, uh, any type of, of restaurant, any type of business has a DMO. And this is the DMO for your USANA business. I also want to remind you there's three keys to have a breakthrough in your business. Number three is to stick to your strategy, the DMO. Number two is the stories you tell yourself. If you tell yourself you're too old or if you tell yourself you're too young or if you tell yourself you don't have enough time, then you're going to be right. You have to change your story. You have to tell yourself every day you can do it. You have to tell yourself every day you're worth it. You have to cons consistently tell yourself the positive stories. Uh, I, I tell myself stories uh, every morning in my, with my affirmations when I go brush my teeth. I, I see my, my business. I see my goals. And I, I, convince, I can consistently tell myself the right stories. That is critical to a breakthrough in your business. And the number one most important thing for a breakthrough is the state that you're in. That's your energy and your state of mind. If your energy is high, if you're happy, if you're moving, they say emotion is created by motion. So be in motion. Uh, stand up, jump around before you make some calls, get the blood flowing, be positive. If you're in a depressed state, do not make phone calls. Make sure that you're in a happy state and you control these three things. Then you'll have a breakthrough in your business. All right. So let's actually give some recognition to the people who have been doing the DMO and you can tell because they're getting results. So first of all, let's give a big congratulations to the new clients that have started with us in this past week. Uh, welcome, Laura and Manuel Garcia, new clients introduced by Ruby Perez. Way to go, Ruby. Back on the boards. Really proud of you. Also, welcome Mario and Juanita G uh, Rodriguez, new clients introduced by Claudia Zacharias. This is her parents. Very good, Claudia. Very proud of you. And welcome, Mario and Juanita. Also, welcome Wick Rick Carreno, new client introduced by Lorena Galdiano. Way to go, Rick. Welcome to the USANA family and great job, Lorena. Welcome, Jose Garcia, new client introduced by Lorena Galdiano. Welcome, Jose. Great job, Lorena. Welcome, Lauren Speeders, new client introduced by Jared Harris. Way to go, Jared. Way to hit the board again. Proud of you, man. And welcome, Lauren. Welcome, Nancy Lee, new client introduced by Stephanie Giles. Awesome job, Stephanie. You're hitting the board again, too. So many people hitting the board this week. I'm really proud of everyone. Also, welcome Rosie Chavez, new client introduced by Veronica Cade. Awesome, Veronica Cade. And welcome, Rosie. Also, welcome Brenda Hernandez, new client introduced by Veronica Cade. Way to go, Veronica. 
And welcome, Brenda. I love the Wonder Woman outfit. It's phenomenal. Also, welcome Stephanie Vidare, new client introduced by Veronica Cade. Wow, Veronica, you're on fire. Way, way to go. Also, let's welcome the new associates that have started in our business in the last, um, I guess, in the last week. And that would be Daniel Espinoza, new associate introduced by Renee and Megan Martinez. Way to go, Renee. Big welcome, Daniel. I'm not sure if we have Daniel on the line right now. Um, Dad, can you... Can you check? Actually, I don't have his phone number. We'll have to we'll have to interview him hopefully at the end of the call. Renee, can you uh, can you see if Daniel's going to be on? And if he is, would love to say hello to him at the end. All right, let's give some uh, some recognition to some rank advancements we've had. So, me and my wife were number two top earning Emerald directors in the United States market last week. Thank you, team. We appreciate all your hard work. We appreciate your love and support. It's pretty exciting to be one of the top emeralds. Also, big congratulations to number four in the United States, Betty Meyer. That is a big deal. Top preferred customer enroller in the U.S. Way to go, Betty. Very proud of you. Also, globally, she was number nine. That's even harder because the, the USANA world is so big. There's so many people succeeding. Way to go, Betty. That's big time. Also, uh, number five in the United States, Lorena Galdiano. Way to go, Lorena. That's super exciting. Super proud of you, Lorena. And number 10 globally. Wow. Also, number 14 top uh, preferred customer enroller, Jared Harris. Way to go, Jared. On fire, my friend. Also, number 26 top uh, associate sponsor in the United States, Veronica Cade. Wow, Veronica. Way to go. Love it. Special announcements. Okay, everyone, we have an awesome new web conferencing service we're going to start using next week. It's called Zoom. The difference between Zoom and any meeting is like night and day. This is just a whole step up for our team. Uh, it's going to be, we'll, we're, we're going to have capacity to actually see everybody on our webinar. Um, you can watch the webinar on your phone. You won't have to just call in and listen on a recorded line. It works great with Android and with iPhone. And it's a much cheaper service as well. So it's like 10 times better and about three times cheaper. So the whole industry is switching over to Zoom, including us. So this, we're going to be using this service starting next week. Make sure that you register at this link, but do it tomorrow because uh, we haven't changed it yet. But by tomorrow, this link, webinar.teamdsi.info, will now le uh, take you to Zoom, and you will need to re-register for our webinars. So make sure you do that. Make sure that you have your team do that. And um, it's actually not www. I'm sorry. That's a mistake. Don't do the www. Just have webinar.teamdsi.info. That will get you there. And when you go there, you're going to see a meeting registration page just like this. Make sure you put in your first name, last name, your email address, et cetera, and then register. Also, keep growing your business because you could be one of the winners for the growth circle. The top 25 growers from January 7th through March 31st will win an all expenses paid ex uh, extended weekend to the Riviera Maya, Mexico. So there is so many amazing things going on in our United States market. Um, you got to just keep doing what you're doing. I'm proud of every one of you for building your business. Uh, I expect one of you to be winning this very soon. And they do this every quarter. So uh, I want to win it too. Me and my wife are going for it as well. Love Nutramil. We got the, the Nutramil single pack still available, all three flavors. And then we have Nutramil back permanently, French vanilla and Dutch chocolate and strawberries available while supplies last, which is awesome. And then our track WAP and win incentive is still going on. And uh, right now we have Veronica Cade in first place with 140 points, Renee and Megan Martinez with 118, and Don Morales with 104. So we have three top players, um, but we have everyone on this list that's been doing really good. I'm very proud of each and every one of you uh, that have been been playing there's only two weeks left of this incentive and what uh if you if you're wondering what is this incentive like i've never heard of it um basically you win by getting points you get 10 points for doing the 52 week binder five points for registering for us celebration five points for rank advancing um, three points for posting your weekly action plan three points for posting your dmo tracker three points when you personally sponsor new associates uh five points um for 
actually five points for associates, three points when they register for the event. So you get points just by signing people up and doing the right behaviors. And what do you win? Well, basically you win cash. The first place prize is $400. The second place is 250 and the third place is 150. Now that's if you're going to con uh, to the next big event. If you don't, then those prices get, uh, those, those cash prizes get cut in half. Um, so, so yes, for sure. Um, it's an awesome incentive. We, we do these incentives regularly because they, they do such great, amazing things for our team. So I want to um, encourage you, if you're not playing already, to get in the game. Um, contact your mentor. Start learning because, you know, this incentive is almost over, but we're going to be starting a, a new one right around the corner. So that's the GoPro incentive. Um, or Sorry, the uh, WAP and Wind a Celebration incentive. And um, very, very excited for these last two weeks to see who wins. All right. So before we get into the training, just a friendly reminder: when you enroll a new associate, make sure or a new client, make sure you add them to the Usana clients page, um, right there, and make a post and a picture and make them feel special and important. That's very, very critical. And um, also, when you enroll a new associate, make sure you add them to uh, the Team DSI page, which is um, Duplicate Success International, right there. And then go ahead and post a picture. You guys have been doing phenomenal at commenting. Our community is so great. I can tell our community is present because everyone comments. I'm proud of you uh, for commenting all, on all the new clients and associates that enroll. Also, when you uh, enroll a new associate, make sure you add them to hybrid solutions. That's another important one, hybrid solutions. Um, that's for associates only. And, um, and that, that, that does it. That gets us to... Um, to our great training. We're, we have an amazing training that's about to happen. I hope you're um, sitting on the edge of your seats, ready to take notes and learn from Executive Gold Director Viola Krebs and her top two team members that went to Las Vegas, um, Stephanie Giles and Phyllis Walker. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass the controls back to um, Viola, Randy and Viola. And then we're gonna, uh, we're gonna take just a little 10 second pause and then we'll get right on it. Um, how do I do this? Stop screen sharing. There we go. Okay, let me see if I can. Because I'm going to need you to uh, unmute the, the team when we bring them up. Not the team, isn't it? Or just uh, Phyllis and Stephanie. Sorry. Okay, can you see our screen? I can. So it's it's good right there. Let me do it. Yep. Okay. Um. All right. So we'll need you to unmute. Actually, okay. why why don't you unmute Stephanie right now? Okay, I'm looking for her phone number. No, it's her name. It's down towards she, the bottom. She's uh. On Let me see it. All right, Stephanie, I unmuted you, so um, can you unmute yourself, please? There we go. Testing one, two, three, Stephanie. Can you hear me? Oh, yep. perfect. Awesome. All right. And then I'm going to go ahead and unmute um, Phyllis. Well, you can now or one at a time. That way you won't hear any background noise. Well, well, actually, it would be better to unmute them in advance so that my Facebook Live video doesn't get interrupted. Ah, well, I knew there was another reason. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, um, you introduce mom and uh, we'll yeah. go. Okay, great. So give me just a minute here. All right. All right, in five, four, three. Hello, my name is Jared Krebs. I'm pictured here with my wife, Crystal, and our dog, Tasia. We're Emerald Directors, co-founders of Team DSI. And tonight's training, we have the privilege of hearing from Executive Gold Director Viola Krebs, who was just in Las Vegas at the GoPro event called The Most Powerful Women in Network Marketing. And she took her top two team members, Achiever Phyllis Walker and Builder Stephanie Giles. Very proud of all of you for 
going to this event, investing extra, really, because this event is on top of all the USANA events that we do. So your commitment is just so high, all three of you. Um, Viola, thank you so much for being such a great mom, for being such a great influence in my life, and for being such a powerful, powerful leader in our business. I love you and appreciate you and cannot wait to hear about this recap. Uh, so take it away. Well, thank you, Jared. I am still so excited. I'm still walking on cloud nine. In fact, I'm still in Las Vegas. <laughs> the, the event was held at the Mirage in Las Vegas, and I was there with two of my most powerful women, members, Phyllis Walker and Stephanie Giles. And there were probably five, 5,000 people, around 5,000 people at the event. But boy, I sure want to take more of my team members next year. This was my first one I've attended, the Powerful Women in Network Marketing. I have attended, I think, three of the GoPro events with Eric Worre. This one is definitely different. Obviously, it was for women, but there were some men that were there. So it was an event for women by women. And men were not allowed to talk on stage with the exception of the couples panel. And you can see the picture here on the left. I'm, I'm pictured with Marina Wari. She is Eric Wari's wife. And this is her event. She puts on the women's event. And to the right, I'm pictured with Eric Wari, who was the host and the MC of the event. So they were both on stage. Um, Eric was probably on stage quite probably more than I expected because he was the MC. Um, but it was obviously none of the men actually were on there. That they were strictly women that were on stage. So I just wanted to share this fact real quick. Um, the gender makeup of direct sellers. Uh, on average, 76% of people in our profession are women. So that's huge. You can see uh, from 2012 to 2015, it's uh, a big number there, 76% on average. So with that, I want to turn the time over to um, Stephanie Giles. She was with us here in Las Vegas, and she is a builder with USANA, and I'm so honored to have her on our team because she is a visionary. She's been with USANA for six months, six short months, and she's a lifetime premier platinum pay setter. And I can tell you that I was inspired by her to attend this event. It was her idea. And so like they say, you learn from your downline. And so I obviously, I have to thank her for um, inspiring me to go to this event. Stephanie is also a busy mom of three teenage daughters and is devoted to working on herself and her personal development. So Stephanie, are you there? I am. Stephanie, can you share some of the your nuggets that re you received from the event and tell the team why you were so excited about being being there? Oh, um, I actually signed up and sent in my form before we even left GoPro back in December. I was so excited. I loved hearing the women. And after hearing the women's panel at GoPro, I was so excited to see some of the women again. Um, one of the ones that I absolutely loved but did not get a picture with her was Susan Sly. Um, but right here I'm pictured with um, Eric Worre and Marina and Phyllis. Um, it was absolutely amazing. Um, when we first started the event, Eric Worre got up and he told us the four things we were going to get out of the weekend was we were going to develop a million dollar mindset. Um, number two, we were going to develop skills and we were going to learn what we needed to do. And we were going to learn a strategy on how to take our mindset and our skills and how to make those work for ourselves. And then our fourth thing is that we were going to expand our vision and give us the potential to become who we are. Um, and then at the very end, when we went to the flower power party, I, um, I got to meet both of them and thank them for the wonderful event. And it was neat because I got to give them both a hug. And Marina, when I gave her a hug, she told me, take what you just learned and go forward and do. And so I thought that was amazing that she was able to just give me this little teeny tip of information that was extremely valuable. Um, can you give me my next slide? Yes, and I, I just want to tell you, I love your slide. It's fantastic. <laughs> it's fantastic. All right, um, as a, next one's coming up. This is um, at the Flower Power Party. These were 
the women that we were able to catch, that I was able to catch and get pictures with. Um, in the top left, it's um, Denise, and I can't remember what her last name is. Um, she's in the orange dress. Yeah, and then um, the one up in the corner is um, Lisa Grossman. Absolutely loved her. She's been in the business as long as Eric Worre. And she said she is a true believer in network marketing. And her main thing that she talked about was love. If you can't love the people that you're trying to serve and get into the business, um, no one's going to want to do business with you. You have to be a people person and just love, 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 love everyone. And I absolutely love that. Um, down in the corner, we're with um, Debbie and Jeff Beebe. They were on a couples panel. Absolutely amazing. The couples panel, it was just fun to see the dynamics of how these people build their business together and pretty much almost every single one of them, the woman started the business and then the man came along later on, um, which was fun to see and just to see the dynamics. Um, and the other picture, um, Phyllis and I are with Kirsten and Denny Johnson and they were just amazing people to see. Um, and it was just fun to get to take pictures with them and get to know them and just kind of just thank them for what they were able to give us during the conference. Um, can you give me my next slide too? Um, and my next slide, okay. Eric Worre told us to write down our top five things that we got out that we were going, we had gotten out of it so far on Friday night. Um, and these are two of my top five. And the first one was, we have to believe in ourselves. If I can't believe in myself, I can't become who I want to be. Um, and then the next day, um, Stefani talked about it. And these were a couple of her slides. She said, you can look in the mirror and you can be a kitten, but you need to release and become the lion and the queen that we are, um, which I absolutely loved. Um, it gives me a goal to continue to build and move more. Um, and the other one of the other ones was um, that we need to be authentic. If we're not authentic and true to ourselves and what our beliefs are and what we want to do, there is no way that we can continue on and that we have to be dreamers. We have to be set big goals. And if we can't dream big, we're not going to ever make it big, um, which I really loved that we could do that um, and that our mindset is just absolutely what will put us where we need to be. And I know I'm um, doing the GoPro coaching that Eric Worre has, and that is a lot of what it's teaching me is uh, it's all about your mindset. And if you can't think it, you'll never become it. Um, can you switch slides for me? Oh, that's powerful, Stephanie. Love the slide as well. All right, and my next one, um, it says, Sometimes life is about the ability to believe in where you are going, even when you are not sure what lies ahead, um, which I absolutely love because we never know what's going to hit us. I'm like shortly after I started this business, my health went downhill. I had to take several months off. I had so many nerves burned in my back and in my neck that I just felt like I was going to die. But I've gotten over those and I've healed and I got my health back on starting to get back on track. And now it's I'm going towards and stepping forward and moving like those footprints in the sand towards the ocean and where I want to become and where I want to be. And so um, you can't use an excuse. You have to keep going and you have to just keep trying no matter what. Um, can you give me my next slide? Um, my next one, um, I know Viola's told me over and over that I've been really good at this, that I followed, I've been teachable, that I've been, I do what I'm told. Um, and I think that's true. We have to be teachable. We have to have that heart to want to learn and be humble. If we don't have that, we're not going to be successful at all. And the other thing that they kept re reinforcing over and over and over this weekend was, we have to be grateful. And if we can't say thank you and be grateful for who we are and what we are, it's not going to do us any good. Um, and I love this quote the, on the bottom by um, Stefania. Um, she's a wonderful person from Italy. It, she said, I can do all things through Christ, which strengthens me, which that is a huge motto in my life. Oh, I just lost what's online. Can you guys still hear me? I can still hear you perfectly. Okay, hold on. My screen just cut out on me. 
Okay, can you give me the next slide? Hi. I think I've got like two more, I think. Okay, um, I've got three. Um, this one I just loved. I'm like, they kept talking about enthusiasm and that we just have to have energy and enthusiasm. It's kind of like Tony Robbins taught us back in uh -oh. December. I don't hear you, Stephanie. Oh, can you hear me? I'm like, oh, can you hear me? Hello? I can hear you, Stephanie. You can hear me? Oh, yes. Okay. Can everybody, can anyone else hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Stephanie. I okay. Can hear okay. You. Good. Awesome. I can't see anything on my screen, so I'll just go off what's on my phone. Okay. Um, <laughs> so we have to have energy. We have to be excited. We have to have that enthusiasm and energy, and our energy will give us what we need. Um, and I also like the little quote that it says that um, we already, that we are enough because we are women. Um, women have power behind us and that we can be successful. Um, I got a couple more slides. Um, if you want to show them, I don't know. If, I just can't see them on my screen. All right. Um, your, so, smile. your smile. Yep. Okay. And uh, it just turned off on me. Hey, it says your smile is your logo. Your personality is your business card. How you leave others feeling at the end of your experience is your trademark, which I thought was absolutely amazing. I'm like, if we can do those three, four things that will just help us in everything that we do. And if you want to give me my last slide, it just says, do what you love and love what you do. If you don't love what you do, you can't succeed in anything. So those were the things that I learned and that I found most valuable this weekend. Thank you so much, Stephanie. I certainly enjoyed spending the, the whole weekend with you and I love you so much and love everything that you said on this webinar. Thank you so much for sharing some of your nuggets that you got with the team and i'm sure we will see you at the next event yep thank you all right so we're going to move on and i am going to have the honor of introducing phyllis walker phyllis is an achiever with usana and what i'm so impressed with phyllis is that she is totally committed to her personal growth and her usana business I can say she's not only my business partner, but now she is one of my dearest friends. And that, that always happens with you, Sana. I'd like for her to share some of her insights on the event. Phyllis, are you there? I am Viola. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Just let me know when you want me to switch slides. Hey, so for those of you that don't know me, I'm Phyllis Walker. I live in Bountiful, Utah. And, um, I've been in USANA for 21 years. Uh, you can change the slide now. Okay. We went that to was Las a great, Vegas. That was a great picture of you and Eric, by the way. Oh, thank you. Um, we went to Las Vegas, as you know, to see uh, Marina Wari's uh, most powerful women in network marketing. And uh, we got to spend a little bit of time the day before just checking out Vegas, and um, this is Randy, myself, Viola, and Stephanie. Um, it was a fabulous three days, um, and Randy happened to be our private chauffeur. And thank you, Mr. Randy Krebs. Well, that's thank the you. least I could do. <laughs> yeah, I'm, hey, I'm in Vegas, you see. He had it down. Yeah. We were chauffeured by the most handsome man, and we tipped him well. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> I saw a hat in Vegas. It was actually at the seminar that said, never give up. I didn't buy it because after 21 years in USANA, I am living it. I haven't given up. USANA is one of the most, the greatest company for network marketing. Um, at the convention, I was very empowered, but also humbled to be in a room full of very bright women, successful women at that. Um, if you'll put um, the next slide. Hello? Yes, the four, four types of people. 
Yes, I don't see any slides. Okay. Um, so Marina Worry was the woman in charge, and Eric Worry was the MC. The woman I felt most connected to was Denny Robinson, and that's the slide that should be there. And I don't see any slides. Okay, Jared, I had to go back out and go back in. I'll edit all this out. You may need to pass me back control. Okay, it's it's yours. Sorry, Phyllis. All right. Technical difficulties for a moment. If you're on Facebook, hit hit loves and likes and comment. There we go. Is that the slide you want? That was the beginning, and then you. Um, I think see. Danny Robinson is I what she wanted. Danny. Yes, I need Danny. Yes. Okay. Okay. This is Denny Robinson, and she's the woman that I felt most connected to through the whole convention. I mean, seminar, even though. All the women were fabulous. Her bio says she's passionate about health and wellness and is making a difference to humanity. And that's what we're all about in USANA. She said when she wakes up in the morning, she th says thank you seven times. I don't wake up thanking God, but in the evening, I do have a gratitude journal. And I list anywhere from three to ten things I'm grateful for for the day. Um, she said, how many success stories do you need to hear before you start your own? That kind of hit home with me. I hear all these stories, and I'm kind of envious. So I thought, okay, she's right. I need to start my own story, my success story. <laughs> Next slide. The four types of people. She talked about consumers, connectors, builders, and leaders. A consumer is a PC or an associate who buys the products at best value. The connectors are the people that are the life of the party, but they don't seem to be good at following up. The builders, I want to do this. They do everything and do the steps necessary to be successful. But the leaders are few and far between. Either with, they've either had previous network marketing experience, and they say, with or without you, I am going to do this. And they also plug into, uh, plug people into a system, which Jared and Crystal and Randy and Viola, God bless them, have done that. And we have a wonderful team, Team DSI. She also talked about whoever leave, loves, let's see, who, she who loves glitter, le, oh, I am so sorry. She who leaves glitter in her path will never be forgotten. That is a, a great saying. And in truth, that has happened to me. In my younger days, I used to dress flashy. And I can say some people still remember. <laughs> um, she also says, uh, Demi also says, don't be threatened if someone passes you up in rank. It's called residual income. And that's what Renee mentioned last week about Veronica Cade. She is right on Renee and Megan's tail. And the last thing I wrote down about her is she said, the secret to getting to the top is to get off your butt and never forget how proud looks on you. The next uh, speaker that I was really um, pleased with was Lisa Grossman. Stephanie mentioned a little bit about her. She was our first speaker. She talked about being suffering from TB, true believerism. In network <laughs> marketing, we, <laughs> that made me chuckle too when she said that. In network marketing, we want people to be better than ourselves because they exalt us and don't diminish us. 
she has a great approach. And I really like this. She said, ask someone if they're happy. Or ask them if they're satisfied with their life. If they say no, then say, do you have a plan to change it? Would you like to see one? Or you can say, this may not be for you, but I want to show you a plan. I could, I could feel comfortable approaching people that way. So I really like the way she worded it. And um, let's see. One of, the, one of the speakers in the couples panel said, I am a champion. She had us repeat it several times. I am a champion. I am a champion. Kind of like our affirmations, like Jared said. There is a champion inside each one of us. We have greatness, but some of us have a terror barrier. I know I do, personally. I'm, I'm afraid to appro approach people. So she said, we need to break through the terror barrier. And I will start working on that today. The next slide, please. Woohoo! This was the flower power that we got to enjoy with everybody all in our flower dresses and skirts. And it was amazing. We saw dolphins playing. We saw white tigers. We saw white lions. It was just an amazing ending to this powerful weekend. Um, next slide, please. Um, the flower power party, this is Marina and Stephanie and I, we were so fortunate to get in, in line and be able to get our picture taken with her. She is so beautiful and she was so warm and, and loving and caring and I thanked her very much for such a wonderful weekend with all these women and she said, did you learn anything? And I said, yes. And she said, then take it and go change lives. I, I was just so impressed by this. And um, it was a wonderful, wonderful seminar. And thank you for your time and listening. Thank you, beautiful Phyllis, beautiful Stephanie, and beautiful Marina. Um, for sharing with our team and there will be another event similar to this. I, I want to share some of my nuggets that I got now. So I am going to um, change slides here. Obviously, I wish I could regurgitate everything that I learned because it's, it was all so good. Um, there were five different panels and, you know, panels are really that, that, you know, covered what five times six people. That's 30, 30 women that we actually got to hear from. The one, one of the, the the first one was the rising star panel, and then we had also a social media panel, a mompreneur panel, a couples panel, panel, and a million dollar earner panel. Um, <clears throat> with the rising star panel, so these are women that are up and coming rising stars. Um, so you you learn something from each diff, each one. Um, one of the things that I learned, one, one of the um, women here was talking about. There's three different types of people. There's the naysayers, the lovers, and the haters. So the naysayers are, let's say your family. They, they liked where you were before they met you. <laughs> they don't want you to succeed, okay? Um, those are the naysayers. And then there's the lovers. They love you no matter what. And then there's the haters. So to me, when I was like, I felt like I was hated upon many times. <laughs> and you know, it's, it's just, I got a new perspective on it. So but what this woman said is when they hate you, you, you lose your mind, but the haters make you famous because others will watch and realize that they like what you're doing. So you really want to give me more haters. <laughs> so um, anyway, that was an interesting perspective, which uh, really, really resonated with me. Also, um, the uh, mompreneurs, the mompreneurs uh, really gave me a lot of insight, a, a tool that is, is going to help me uh, when, I'm help when I'm working with someone who has children, such as young children, for example, I never really knew how to help them. But what one of the mompreneurs said was that there's a different season of the different age groups. 
So if you have zero to six years, you have children that are zero to six years old, get help. She said, just get babysitters, get, have your husband watch while you work on your business, but get help. The second season is the six year olds to the 12 year olds. So you want to do your USANA or your, your uh, business work while, you, while they're in school. And then there's the 12 to 18 year olds and that's the third season. And you really want to involve your kids at that age because your kids are watching you. They're even watching you from a very young age. So let them see your business lift you up. You don't want to let them see you all stressed out or they're not going to think it's very cool. And um, you want them to see, you want them to answer the question, what's my family's experience of me in this business? You want that to be a good example, a good experience. They want to see a good experience coming out of you. One of the moms here was talking about how she was on a business call and there were two little boys. She had three little boys, I think it was boys. And the minute she would get on the phone, they would start just raising all kinds of trouble. So she was on the phone with the prospect and she, there, was a, there was a roll of duct tape on the table. So she actually took the duct tape while she was talking to her prospect and taped the two boys together. The other one shot out and um, she was just so angry that she you know, finally said to her prospect, let me just call you back. But I can imagine they do make you crazy. I know we have a, a two-year-old little grandson that we, we have quite often and um, I have a better perspective and uh, empathy for, for moms. So I really learned a lot from the mom, mompreneurs. Also on social media panel, one of the things I learned on that was to be on point with your personal branding on Facebook. So um, first of all, they said, don't have your company as your branding. Also don't have a picture of your cat or your dog as your profile picture. Um, and to find out how you're doing with your branding, you want to you wanna have like five words or things that represent you and no more. So you want to put a post out there. Ask your Facebook friends, um, what are five words that remind you of me? And that's going to be interesting. I'm going to actually do this and see what five words I get back. And if you have more than five, you're kind of all over the place. You want to kind of hone it down. So they gave us just so many good tips, so many good tips on that. Susan Sly, here's Susan Sly, Stephanie. Um, she's powerful. I, I really enjoyed what she had to share with us. She is a best-selling author and mother of five. And she talked about follow-up. She said, instead of creating millionaires, she's interested in creating millions of thousandaires. Follow-up is about creating a habit of loving people more. So you know how sometimes you have to keep following up and following up with the same people like sometimes years. And you know, it gets to be a little, to me, it was like kind of a nuisance after a while. It's like, make a decision already. But now I have a new perspective of, you know, it's about creating a habit of loving more people. So well, that's good. That's going to help me be better. Uh, the most important person you need to recruit is, is ourselves. Follow up as long as it takes. And 80% of sales require five follow-ups. The end is not the end. So never write anybody off. Comfort zone is the death of dreams. And oh, here's a good one. Okay, so I'm sure you've all heard this. Uh, some people say, you know what? I can't do this business because my husband doesn't support me. Susan Sly says, quit asking for that. Quit asking for your husband to support you. It's respect from them that you want. Respect is not given, especially by man, if it is not earned. So earn respect from them by getting results. And they'll just automatically support you. That was good. That was really good. There, there seemed to be a common theme throughout the, the whole seminar. And it was about being authentic and getting in peak state. So you know how we learned from Tony Robbins to get in that emotionally uh, high energy peak state well all these women talked about that everyone had high energy and the person who closed the seminar was a perfect example of getting in peak state her name is nurka and nurka oh wait before i talk about nurka i gotta i gotta just share this with you guys because it's pretty exciting i ran into masa and miguel from pajama bosses and you guys might not know who they are but they are from Australia. They're very high earning network marketers that now have a training system that we have learned from and studied with pajama bosses. 
So when I saw them in the hallway, I, I was really excited because I had to just go introduce myself and tell them that, hey, I wanted to let you know that your your you know what we learned from you is helping us with our systems. And I was so impressed that Masa recognized me. And I've never talked to her personally. Um, Jared has, and I think Jared's Facebook friends with her, but she is such a professional that that is very important. And she was calling me by my first name. She's the one that asked for the picture to be taken. I didn't even have to ask her. She wanted this photo taken. And I told her that it very much helped our uh, one our, our one day, our one week, our three, let's see, what's the next one? Uh, the one month, right? A system. And so um, she actually had me do a short little video for for a testimonial for her business. But it was pretty exciting. I was pretty excited to meet them. Okay, so here's Nurka that I was talking about. When she came on stage, you could feel the energy. She is the creator of the art of supreme influence, a, transform, a transformational leader and master trainer and author. She, by, by the age of 20, she was the number one corporate trainer for Anthony Robbins. So she spent like five years with him, just almost living with him. She's a legend with unbeatable records. And to me, she almost seemed like a female version of Tony Robbins. I mean, she would be on stage and she'd be kind of jumping up, getting in state. You could feel her energy. And she said to put yourself in environments that call for more. You step into your opportunity and you will be given firm ground to walk on and given wings. I mean, the way she said everything, just like, bam, I could just see it. Uh, she said, you do not describe what you see. You see what you describe. And if you think about that again, you do not describe what you see. You see what you describe. So, for example, if you see your team, you're thinking, okay, I'm describing what I see. But in reality, you've already described it in your mind. And so now you're looking at what your mind has put out there. That's your team. The results are the mere result of the conversations you're having with yourself. What kind of conversations are you having with yourself? The quality of your life and business reflect your emotional state. If you're bored and restless and stressed out, opportunities won't come to you. Be on the edge of your seat, live life ready, and watch the opportunities come. She talked about language. She talks about communication. And she says, are you ch championing your highest vision? You create as you speak. I am is a statement of identity. What you speak will come find you. If you say, I am fat, fat will come find you. If you say, I am new, rookieism will come find you. So true. She says to live in supreme influence. And she says, if adversity comes, you walk forward until adversity walks backwards and falls off the end of the planet. Live with awareness and an expanded heart and everything will align. Just powerful. She totally rocked my world. I came home. I listened to her again. I got on her website, listened to more of her stuff. And I'm telling you, I am a huge Nurka fan after this event. <laughs> the dolphins, yay! You can see there's three dolphins there. We got to see them jump up and do tricks. And then there was the Siegfried and, and Roy lions and tigers there was it's, it was kind of like a zoo i kept saying those fences are in my way of my picture and i remember stephanie saying i want those fences up leave them up <laughs> it was fun we had a great time here's the three of us from our team i am visualizing that we are going to have a larger group next year and um the dates for next year are april 13th through the 15th at the mirage again in las vegas um we have not totally committed to going to this event yet, just because it may fall right on national for USANA. So Eric, Eric Worre always says, you go to your USANA, or not your USANA, your business event um, first. If it falls on this date, you don't come to this, you go to your event. So we're waiting to see uh, when our national for 2018 is. Hopefully it doesn't fall on this date because I certainly do not want to miss it. I am a huge, huge fan of this event now that I've been, been to. And I want to thank you all for giving me the opportunity to share some of uh, my insights. Wow, Mom, I loved it.
Thank you so much. It was amazing, amazing webinar. I can't wait to hear about all the success that's coming from you from, from attending it and applying all the things you learned. Thanks for, for making such a great training tonight. You're welcome. All right, everyone, pull out your calendar for 2017. To end our webinar, we're just going to get make you aware of the upcoming events. So March 18th is the next big event in the United States market. It's in Washington, D.C., and that's the U.S. National Celebration. And uh, that's going to be um, – actually, we have Bonnie Thornton – no, no, not Bonnie Thornton. We have uh, Becky Armstrong and Christian Glad going to Washington, D.C. So way to go, Becky Armstrong and Christian Glad. That's very exciting. Our team, Team DSI, will be represented in Washington, D.C. Next is uh, – after that, the next week will be Chicago, Illinois – and Bonnie Thornton will be going to Chicago, Illinois from Team DSI and bringing two people with her. So that's awesome. Team DSI will be well represented in Chicago, Illinois, March 25th. If you have anyone in the Midwest in the Chicago area, make sure you get them that information. Next is um, San Antonio, Texas. Well, we will be beyond well represented in San Antonio. We have over 30 people, actually 33 people registered currently for San Antonio. Um, I think we can get it to 50 and beyond, really. Um, so I'm excited. I'm very proud of everybody who's registered. Hey, um, by the way, if you have clients here in San Antonio that you want to go to this, it's only $65 for their ticket. Tell them it's an all-day event. It's an investment in their health. It's an investment in their life. Also, prospects can go to this for $65 as well. I tell prospects, if you're serious about this and you want to do your research, come to this event in San Antonio. It's the very best thing you can do. So I want to encourage you to get your prospects registered. Get your clients registered and obviously get your associates registered many of you have vouchers that you haven't used yet make sure you get those applied and you go to the san antonio celebration next slide um san diego california so um in san diego we actually have randy and viola krebs that will be there um as well as phyllis walker will be there as well and sherry bender so that's exciting we'll be well represented in san diego as well on april 8th and if you, again, same thing, if you have people in the California area, this is the event to be at. Next slide. Now, this is the most important event of the year. If you go to any event in 2017, this would be, if you go to one, this would be the one. This is USANA's International Convention. And uh, Dad, can you move your mouse, actually? Thank you. To the, to the right, thank you. Um, this event right here, August 16th through the 19th, is actually... Um, the international convention. So this is different than the regional celebrations. The international convention literally will have people from all 20 countries. It's over 10,000 people. And guess what? It's already sold out. So you cannot get a ticket unless you go buy it on Facebook. Okay. So there's people selling tickets on Facebook, like because of maybe they, they bought a ticket and they can't go. So if you want to go and you don't have a ticket yet, you let me know. You let my parents know. You let your USANA uh, mentors know. And we will find you a ticket because you do not want to miss this. Dr. Oz will be there. Dr. Wentz, our founder, will be there. All the top doctors in wellness, all the top Million Dollar Club members. You've got to be at this event Wednesday, August 16th through Saturday, August 19th. Um, next slide, please. Look at all the people we have registered um, for this event. We have actually over 50 people on our team already registered for this event. I'm super proud of everybody on this list. Actually, we're... This actually, we need to update that list. Um, Dad, let me let me take over. Um, let me take over because these these slides that I have, uh, I need to show the plane ticket prices. Good point. Okay, stand by. Okay, bear with me, guys. It's gonna be worth gonna be worth it. See if you can do it now. I I'm doing it right now. Okay. All right. You can see my screen. Yes. All right. So these are the people that are registered for the convention a year in advance. Um, obviously, this is going to be an amazing event. Um, but here's the, the plane ticket prices right now. If you're and this is actually people flying from San Antonio to Salt Lake City. This is an amazing price. Um, actually, no, this one is the, the flight. If you're you're, you're going to fly from um, from Salt Lake, or if you fly from your city, this is this is an example, San Antonio. You fly from San Antonio to Salt Lake City round trip. You would fly on Tuesday the 15th, and you would return on Monday the 21st. The ticket is 
uh, round trip on a flight. That's actually very good. Anything under $300 is good. You need to plan for this, this ticket. I know some of, many of you are in San Antonio. Some of you aren't. So if you're not, then you need to obviously fit, get on get on southwest.com or whatever. But if you if you fly home on Sunday the 20th, the price goes up like to 362. So that's another like $80 to go home on Sunday the 20th. So that's why I usually tell people get your flight in advance, start planning. I mean, you know, it's uh, hopefully you can re return home on Monday the 21st. That way your flight will be a little bit cheaper. But if you need to return home on uh, August 20th, it's going to be 362. This is a business. You have to invest. You have to invest in your education. It's the most important event of the year. We're telling you in advance so you get your money together um, for your flights. This is what it's all about right now is getting your flights. It doesn't even matter if you have your, your convention ticket. If you don't have your flight, that's when we know you're really going is when you bought your flight. All right. So success on the beach is uh, the next event, Mark, uh, November 8th through the 12th. That's five days in Punta Cana with your USANA family. That's a USANA vacation. You can win that trip, have it all expense paid, or you can earn it partially, have it halfway paid for, or just pay your own way and go on a vacation with your USANA family. Um, that video right there, puntacana.teamdsi.info has all of the info on that. Also, mark your calendars, November 16th through the 18th, Las Vegas Convention Center, GoPro Recruiting Mastery. Um, payment plans are available if you want to get a $400 ticket. This is the most expensive event of the year, but it's, it's also the only event where they allow only six-figure per month income earners. Um, Eric Worre obviously is there. He's the master, grandmaster of the event. Anthony Robbins, the world-famous international thought leader and Pitbull, who's not only an, a, a fabulous uh, entertainer, he's also a very strong entrepreneur. So you're going to be learning from the best in business in November 16th through the 18th. Many of you are already registered. Texas Associates, we're having a big landmark event Tuesday, March 14th. And if you, um, if you don't know what landmark is, landmark is an event that basically helps you find your blind spots. Um, do you live your life like anything's possible? Do you experience the fullness of life where anything is possible in your relationships, in your career, with your family, with your finances? Landmark has uh, been a huge, huge, uh, in, uh, how do you say it? It's really changed mine and Crystal's life. And so we're bringing this event to San Antonio. And um, this is actually a free event. It's an introduction to Landmark. Their weekend seminar is $600. So Again, it's an investment. You can actually lock in a price for two hundred and and lock in the seat. But at this event, you learn all about it. But I tell people be financially ready because if you decide you want to do this weekend, got to at least put two hundred down to uh, lock in your ticket. But that takes you next level. That's like steroids for you. You saw a business. So mark your calendars Tuesday, March fourteenth. Utah Associates. Um, there's going to be a health and freedom. Uh, Thursday, March 9th at the USANA Home Office featuring April London, a foundation executive, two-star diamond director, million-dollar club member. Uh, so make sure you're there. Make sure you're you're learning from, from someone who's has had major success in USANA. And then also um, Thursday, March 9th, that's this Thursday at the home of Andrea Hall from 3 to 4.30. Way to go, Andrea. Way to, way to stay consistent with your mixers. That's phenomenal. Really proud of you. Um, and then also Saturday, March 11th at the home of Heidi Kiefer from 4.30 to 6 p.m. Way to go, Heidi. Way to make events happen. If you're watching this and you don't have a, a mixer scheduled, uh, once you do, let us know. We can post it on the Team DSI page or please take, please just do it um, for everybody so everyone can know when your event is. And uh, if you need any templates, we can send you these flyer templates. You can actually put your picture in there, put your date and your address. Also, just a last reminder that we're going to be switching to Zoom starting next week. And tomorrow, you need to go register at webinar.teamdsi.info, um, not the www there. So just uh, webinar.teamdsi.info. That is going to um, allow you to register for our webinar. And we're going to be on Zoom from now on, which means uh, we're going to have a much easier, more smooth experience on our webinars. Um, and then meeting registration. Again, you're going to have to register for your uh, first name, last name, email address. And then lastly, I just want to encourage you to be a professional. You know, this is a, a picture of the bins in the trunk of my car. 
And I always have extra GoPro books, GoPro audios. You saw in the newspapers, I'm always ready. I want to encourage you to be a professional, be ready to build your business and take it to the next level and go pro. We've made it to the end. Uh, we finished in an hour. I'm really excited that we did. We finished on time. Uh, we always like to finish with questions and or comments. I understand that many of you need to get off right now because it's nine o'clock. But those of you who are sticking around, I actually want to start with our new associate, uh, Daniel Espinoza, who uh, I'm going to unmute if he's still on the line. Well, uh, before, he, before he comes on, Jared. Yeah. The registering for the new uh, zoom platform yeah. once they register once they're going to be signed up for all 50 we got 50 webinars um every well every monday for 50 so they only need to register once and then they'll be already uh, signed in for all of them for the whole okay fantastic mm -hmm. thank you dad we appreciate it and thank you so much, Dad, also for all your work with Zoom and figuring it out for our team. We really appreciate that. You're welcome. All right. So I'm not seeing Daniel's number. He, oh, there he is. Yeah, I do see it. I'm going to unmute you right now. Daniel Espinoza, welcome to the USANA family. Hey, thank you. <laughs> Tell us, what was the highlight for you on the webinar tonight? Well, I don't know. It was all different. It was all interesting. I like the way they, you know, how you, how it is to talk to different people. I've never thought of it that way. Uh, oh yeah. I'm kind of excited. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, it is very exciting how it works. Um, you know, I can just tell you my, my 11 years with USANA, uh, you know, not only have I been able to replace my income, I haven't worked for anybody since 2007. Um, but I've just gotten so much healthier and made so many amazing friends. And it's just like the benefits just keep going and going, man. So I, I really am excited for you to do your first hour in business with Renee. And then uh, all I can say is just keep, keep uh, meeting with him as much as you can, man. Renee is a master at this business. He can teach okay. you the system. Um, do you want to tell the team really quickly, uh, uh, just a little bit about you, what you do for work, and why are you uh, excited about your USANA business? Uh, well, I'm a, I'm a diesel mechanic. I work in the field. I chase equipment around. And uh, I'm basically getting into USANA because I wanted to get healthier. Uh, I was overweight and everything. Decided it's time to change my life for myself. And while I'm at it, the main reason I signed up is I got a Cousin, um, a cousin was just fighting brain cancer right now that they just found out a month ago. He, uh, that's a type of cancer that he can't, uh, can't be healed, I guess. So I'd like to help him out and at least feel better for as long as he can. And I also have another cousin with lupus. So I'd like to help him out. And that's the main reason I'm, I signed up for USANA is to help my cousins that, that need, or family members that need more help than I do. But at the same time, make myself healthier. Absolutely. That's that's phenomenal, Daniel. Well, I, I, I appreciate your heart. That's really great that you have a heart for helping out your family members and, um, you know, helping out, helping out everybody. And I can just, I can say, I can see that, you know, you're going to go really far in your business. Um, and I declare that possibility that you help thousands of people with this and uh, and also make a great income doing it. That'd be nice. <laughs> awesome, man. I can't I wait forward. to hear how your meeting goes with Renee. Yeah, I'm, I can't wait for it either. <laughs> awesome, my man. Well, welcome to the team and look forward to talking to you every Monday night. Sounds good. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. All right. Let's go to, and by the way, um, please call all the people in your business that were on this webinar tonight. Uh, it's really important that you call the people that were on this webinar uh, so that you can chat with them. And so let's go to uh, the next person. Let's go to Jared Harris from Utah. I just unmuted you, Jared. You have to unmute yourself. What was the highlight for you on the webinar tonight, Jared? If you're able to, there you go. Okay. Can you guys hear me? Yep. Loud and clear. Okay. Uh, so I have to first uh, apologize. Uh, I had to uh, withdraw from uh, this webinar uh, 15 minutes uh, early because I had to do a follow-up call with one of my uh, prospects. So uh, anyways, um, 
Uh, so uh, what's the question, Jared? Uh, what was the what? highlight for you? Oh, highlight. Okay, perfect. Awesome. Okay, uh, so one thing that I really uh, enjoyed uh, f- from basically from all the uh, whole I- I- entire women is to uh, is that they o- that they always said uh, you know to always uh, believe in yourself and uh, you know they showed the uh, image of you know the the cat which the uh, kitten and then and then and then the next image of the uh, lioness and all that stuff it pretty much uh, helps me to uh, think about like you know this is where I'm in my life right now where I'm I'm continuing to uh, build my, myself up. You know, I'm starting to uh, feel the uh, pressure of like, um, like, you know, a uh, pain, you know, f- uh, family and friends, like uh, uh, continuing to uh, be uh, negative at me and all that stuff. But one of the, one of the uh, uh, things that, that really uh, stood out to me uh, was just uh, was to realize, you know, uh, people are not going to, you know, uh, understand me very well until, one day they 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 will till until uh i i become somebody new it's like like i ch- i change my my self so that's what that's that's one thing that that's that's really a key, keeping me uh, going in my use sauna business is, is is to keep on you know pushing forward and not let uh, others stop you because letting because uh, others who uh, try to stop me uh, uh they'll uh the, they 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 want to uh, break me down. They they want to be the the first in line. But we're all in 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 a, in about in a battle together to uh, continue to make uh, progress and to uh, and be successful in our lives. And that's, that's right. What, really, at yeah. the end of the day, all we are is helping people. That's, that's right. That's doing. I mean, why hate something that that helps so many people? Right. You know? Absolutely. So, I'm proud of you, Jared. Keep it up, man. Keep, keep thank up. you. Keep, keep up the great mindset stuff, bro. I'm really proud. That's I think that's your biggest strength is your mindset. So keep it up. Thank you. I'm proud of it. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Let's go to Esther Pinales in Dallas, Texas. I just unmuted you, Esther. And, uh... Uh, oh, I'm not sure. If, if you're able to unmute yourself, uh, Esther, please do so. I am not able to unmute. I've unmuted you the furthest I can. So let us know if you, when you unmute yourself, Esther, um, then we'll come back to you. Let's go to Carlos Gomez in Poteet, Texas. Carlos, what was the highlight for you on the webinar tonight? Oh, wait, is this not Carlos? No, this is not. That's Daniel. Sorry, Daniel. Daniel. I was was confused. (laughs) Y'all have the same exact phone number. His is 830-399. And then the last four digits are different. Sorry. Carlos is off the line. Uh, Let's go to Renee Martinez in uh, Pleasanton, Texas. Renee, what was the highlight for you on the webinar? If you're able to unmute yourself. Uh, It looks like... Oh, Esther, you were able to. Esther, what was the highlight for you on the webinar? Can you hear me? Yeah, we hear you loud and clear. Okay. Well, uh, I really liked the the conference, uh, the women conference, and it um, taught me to, you know, to be affirmative and to uh, be uh, stronger at, at things that I, not just to believe that I can do them, but to go forward and do them because that's the only way I'm going to get it done. And that really impressed me with, you know, with the information that your mom had. I I took a lot of notes and I was really impressed with, uh, you know, the, um, I didn't write down her name, but the um, woman that wakes up every morning and says, I'm a champion and and that's what she does. So I'm going to try to do that too. So I can, you know, move forward on, in this business because I'm really excited about it. Fantastic, Esther. Well, I love what you just said because you're right. It's all about mindset. At the end of the day, it's all about mindset and you just nailed it right on the head. That that personal discipline of staying positive and continually putting positive info into your brain is critical. I want to acknowledge you for registering for international convention today. Woo-hoo. Thank you. I got your message. Yay. 
Yes, big deal. Oh my gosh, you're going to have an amazing life-changing time in August. I also want to acknowledge you for registering for the San Antonio event, um, which we'll do tomorrow when we do uh, your training at 7. Okay. Or it might be 7.30 with Veronica. We'll, we'll get back to you on the time um, okay. tomorrow. But uh, it'll be 7 or 7.30. But I'm just really proud of you, Esther. Keep up the great work and uh, can't wait to do our training tomorrow. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. All right. Let's go to Irma Salazar in, I believe it's Pleasanton. Actually, Irma, uh, where are you located? I'm in Pleasanton. In Pleasanton. All right. Irma Salazar in Pleasanton, Texas. What was the highlight for you on tonight's webinar? Um, pretty much all the love that y'all give. I mean, I, that's awesome to hear that. I guess I don't hear it enough. What do you mean by all the love we give? Well, just everybody, how, you know, you're, you support everybody and, and everything really, and, you know, and all the, just trying to get people to join USANA. Absolutely. I feel the love. Oh, that's really awesome. Well, thank you, Irma. And it's, I'm just really proud of you uh, for, for overcoming all the challenges that you have to be in USANA. Um, and congratulations on the leg that's growing in your business. Oh, my gosh. Have you seen, like, all the hundreds and hundreds of points? No, not really. <laughs> okay. I've been really super busy with, with a lot going on. My grandfather is now in hospice, so, of course, busy, you know, with my both of my girls being in sports. Mm -hmm. And I'm really going to try to be more involved in, you know, in USANA. Totally. Well, I totally acknowledge that. I'm sorry to hear that about your grandpa. And, um, yeah, I, I, uh, I just, I'm really proud of you for, for everything you've done so far in USANA and, uh, especially that you're on every webinar. That's so impressive. Yes. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. All right. And let's go to Phyllis Walker. What was the highlights for you on the webinar tonight, Phyllis? I'm sorry. What did you say? What were the highlights for you on the webinar tonight? I was one of the highlights. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you were. Well, it was just good to re go over my notes so I could prepare for today and to hear from Stephanie and Viola um, more of, of the seminar that I was at. It was just absolutely fabulous. And if I can convince the women to go next year, if it doesn't clash with our national, um, you need to be there. It's mind-changing and life-changing. Awesome. Thank you, Phyllis. Love everything you had to say. Thank you. All right. I'll give the final word to Randy and Viola Krebs in Las Vegas. What was the highlight for you, Mom and Dad? Uh, just uh, hearing about the women's event, you know, I, I got a uh, little bit of a dump every evening when I pick them up from the event and wow, uh, just hearing what nuggets they were learning and just, uh, you know, I, I appreciate Stephanie and Phyllis and Viola for uh, putting this together and sharing it with the team because, you know, they only covered a part of how powerful this event was. And, and I agree, Phyllis, if, if this does not interfere with national uh, definitely want to have all the women and I think guys are also allowed as well I think I you know if it doesn't interfere I'll probably go myself next year just to pick up the nuggets oh yeah for sure awesome dad well thank you again thanks for everything you do we really appreciate and love you love you too mom did you have any final words I know I just want to thank everyone for letting uh, me share my little tidbits with everyone and I certainly um, enjoy enjoyed sharing some of it I wish I could could have had at least two hours or three but anyway <laughs> it was awesome. fantastic well thanks mom I loved everything you had to say and thanks for all your hard work and and discipline and diligence and excellence we love you Thank you, Jared. Love you, too. Yes. All right. We're going to end the call with everyone saying good night and God bless. Good night. God bless. Good night. God bless. Good night. God bless. God bless. God bless. God bless. God bless.